Texas Tech has lined up for the kickoff, and we're ready to get this one underway. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. So here comes the offense taking the field for the first time today. right around the 36 yard line when you're running the ball for big chunks of yards like that you've got something working and he's tackled at about the 47 yard line and a nice pick up there i'll tell you what the defense gambled a bit here and came with the blitz and a quarterback showed tremendous poise by making a good read and delivered a nice ball to the open man And down he goes at about the 45. That'll bring up second and three. Brought down at the 35. Taken down around the 26 yard line. Got it, but he's going to lose yards here. And they'll lose a yard there. They really just didn't have any room to work on that play. The defense just suffocated them there. Third and a couple. Ball on the 27. Mike seven. Mike seven. Go ahead, two. Go. And they're not going to get it. Great stop. The quarterback tried to do a little too much by himself. Hey, maybe next time he'll get it out to the back so he can do something with it. that decision it was definitely a first down that they could have picked up you want to be aggressive early on even if it doesn't always work out the quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game defensive coordinator anticipating this five wide set and he comes in with his dime package quick out to his receiver he's pushed out of bounds at the 37 yard line Call it a gain of 10 yards. First down. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. Got an opening to the 10. Touchdown. Huge play. He makes the PAT, a quick two-play, 74-yard drive, and a touchdown's a result. Well, Brad, right now this offense is hot, and they also took advantage of some mistakes there by the defense. He really got a hold of that kick, and they can forget about returning this one. Texas Tech's really got things working right now for him. I can't think of a better start. Well, that's exactly the way they had hoped to see this game go. I mean, anytime you can start the game with a stop, Get your offense out there. They move the ball down, put points on the board. Now it's just more about trying to maintain what they've already created. There's a strike complete. He gets hit out of bounds at the 34. Taken down around the 43 yard line. Throws it in a hurry. He's tackled at the 37. A quarterback's best friend is a receiver he can count on to catch the ball every time he drops back the pass. First down. 
Quick throw out to the receiver. And they make the stop at the 25-yard line. Gets it out to him again. This is smart, efficient play call. You don't need to make the highlight reel on each play. That makes it second and six. Fires it quickly. Looks to the end zone and it's caught. Touchdown. Here comes the kicker to try to tie this game up. And he hits the PAT. A nice six play, 74 yard drive. And it results in a touchdown. You know, when you can throw the football as well as these guys can, you don't necessarily always have to have a balanced attack because you're so proficient at throwing the ball. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down to the end zone for a touchback. I was really impressed with their last series. They came out with a focus on the passing game, and the offense got the job done. We'll see if they have the same strategy here. He's knocked out of bounds around the 31-yard line. That's a gain of six on the play. That'll make it second and four. Slings it. Tackle made at midfield. Nice pickup as they connect on the pass play. Well, they look to be in sync right now. They're both reading the defense properly, and the result is a nice gain. Quick pass going back to his running back, and no one can get it. It bounces out of bounds. They got a little sloppy here with their ball handling. It's a good thing they were near the sideline. Otherwise, the defense could have pounced on that football. It's second down, eight to go. Ball on the 49. Pulls it in, but he can't stay in bounds, and that'll be a loss. That'll make it fourth down, and they're going to have to punt. The defense held their ground on that play. The quarterback just wasn't able to find any open receivers. Booming kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. And as the defense comes back out, you can be sure they're thinking about that score they surrendered the last time around. This quarterback right now is in a rhythm, and a lot of that has to do with his preparation. You can see right now with the reads that he's being able to make, getting the football out of his hands, that he's feeling very, very confident in his ability to throw the football against this defense. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 20-yard line. Black and he throws it away. Great job by the defense of getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. You must be Seven's the mic. Red, two, hit, or hit. <laughs> Balls it in as he's pushed out of bounds. They'll bring him down at the 49. at the 36-yard line. 
touchdown. He tackles him for a loss. These guys have the capability to gain solid, consistent yardage. They have to regroup and come out a bit more motivated next time. From the 39-yard line, second down. He's on the run. He's at the 20, inside the 10. Knocked out of bounds at the five. converts the extra point. Oklahoma State is lining up to kick this one off. He just drills this one. Got the corner. He gets out to about the 22-yard line. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. Fires quickly, and he's got his man, and he's tackled at the 26. That makes it second and six. He wants it all. Caught sideline, and he stays in. So the referee initially calls it a catch, but we'll have a chance to take a second look at it and determine if he really was in bounds when he caught the ball. Well, the side judge was standing right there, so I'd be surprised if he missed that call. After, After review of the, the play, play, the ruling, the ruling on, the on the field stands. stands. Well, I think the play warranted a review, but the call on the field stands. Now it's first and ten after the big pass play. Out of bounds around the 19-yard line. That'll make it second and seven. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. And a great ball game so far as we reach the end of one. Oklahoma State's lead is a touchdown. And we're back for more action here in quarter number two. Gets it out quickly to the back, but he can't haul it in. It's fourth down, and the offense is getting set to go for it. Five wide. He steps out at the 12. I can't believe they actually got the first. This coach isn't afraid to take some risks. First down. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. Pulls down the catch, and he's got room here. Touchdown, Red Raiders. Yeah, baby. That's my boy. This team has so many potent weapons. It's tough to try to single out just one of them to stop. The extra point to tie this game up. He splits the uprights with the extra point. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Excellent kick. He's to the 20. Oh, he got nailed on that one. 
This is the point in the game where you don't want to make any mistakes that give the other guys a reason to feel more confident going into halftime. And he's tackled right away. They come out on an empty backfield. And down he goes at the 47-yard line. Takes the ball inside. And he's stopped behind the line. If these defenders continue to exploit the O-line like that, it's going to be a long day for this running back. From their own 45-yard line, second down. They're not ready for this. Here we go, here we go. There's a very impressive open field tackle. it fly doesn't get there you definitely want to give your receiver some room to run under the ball but not that much and it's the offense that takes the field on fourth down check 31 check 31 seven's a mic gets out to around the 28 one away. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. Red two. X. He's out of bounds right around the 14-yard line. Quickly, and they got it. Touchdown. And a nice catch by the receiver for the touchdown. Anytime you're near the red zone, you got to keep an eye for this guy. They love going to him down here. Tacks on the extra point. Oklahoma State ready to kick this one off. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. Boy, this is turning into a shootout here. Now, remember, the last time we saw this offense out in the field, they answered the bell and scored a touchdown. Can they do that now a second time? There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. Fires that quickly to the tailback. Brought down at the 34-yard line. That brings up second and one. Pulls it in and he's in the open field. Steps out of bounds at the 36. First down. He steps up. Setting up blockers or running backs. Got it on the screen. He's taken down at the 40. Number 24 on the tackle at the 40-yard line. 
That brings him second and five. Check, check, check. Disco Raver! Disco Raver! He goes out of bounds at about the 43 yard line. It's a great tackle at the 50-yard line. Brad, you can really feel and sense the energy coming from the sidelines right now. They know how important it is to pick up first downs. And the coaches right now are showing the excitement that they have and yelling out the next play for the offense. But clearly, the offensive coordinator very happy about the execution on that last play. Catches it, and he's looking for more. The Red Raiders taking their first time out of the half. Two minutes left in the half. Maybe three yards that time on the pass. Wasn't a huge gain here, but at least you know as a quarterback that when you throw to this senior, you're putting the ball into some sure hands. Fires it out. How we do, D. That's how we do. That's how we do. Get a run out of this. That makes it first and ten. Bring it out. Do it, yeah. And he's taken down right around the 20. Texas Tech will have one timeout remaining. From the 20 yard line, first down. We want it. Come to my world. Out of bounds around the 14 yard line. This is the 10th play of this drive. That'll make it second and four. Quick pass, and he's hit immediately. First and goal. They'll spread the field with five wide. Throws quickly into the end zone, caught for the touchdown. That's the second catch for six he's registered today. The quarterback knew exactly where to put the pass, and the receiver went out there and made the grab. Good communication there will be tied with the extra point. And he adds the extra point. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He sends this one deep. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Six points and a pretty display of passing was a result of their last drive. Kirk, do you expect the defense to take a different approach here? When this quarterback is on, he is on. It already seems like whatever this defense is trying just isn't working. But maybe if they add just a little bit more pressure, then they might be able to force him into a mistake. You like a team that's ready to defend the pass. It takes some preparation to get in the way of a pass like that. A quarterback in the gun with five receivers. Here's the call from the referee. Delay of game, offense. They'll line up for another third down Still play third because down. of the penalty. Well, here you're in a third down situation, and then someone makes a mental mistake. It makes your blood boil if you're a coach. From their own 22-yard line, third down. He makes it to the 25-yard line. That's a three-yard pickup on the option. Texas Tech's out of timeout. It looks like they're going to go after this punt. He really got a hold of that one. 
He wasn't breaking that tackle. What a hit. Pretty good job by the return man there. I'm sure that touchdown on their last possessions given them some confidence, but let's see if that carries them back down the field. Well, it's one thing to have speed. It's another thing to have an idea of what you're doing and how to attack a defense. And right now, these wide receivers... Intercepted. He rifles it. He telegraphed that throw. He eyed his receiver the whole way. That was an easy read by the defense. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 42-yard line. They go with the run, and he's tackled in the backfield for a loss. Loss of two by the halfback. The Cowboys are going to call their second timeout. Black five, black five. He's going to go for the home run. And he holds it in. He's all the way. Touchdown. He hits the PAT. Oklahoma State kicked this one off. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. And they can forget about returning this one. Texas Tech's offense struggled in that first quarter, but, man, they've really come to life here in quarter number two. Well, they've hit their stride here offensively. If they could just have their own defense try to come up with a stop or two, they'd have the lead right now. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. He airs it out. Oh, boy, almost intercepted. Second and 10. Ball in the 25. On the ground, inside. He's tackled around the 26-yard line. It's halftime, and we've got a close one. Oklahoma State's lead is a touchdown. We've played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. That first half was a clinic put on by both offenses. In this era of college football, we've seen more and more creativity on the offensive side, and it was on full display in the first half. Yeah, uh, full arsenal and everything you did, you did well. I mean, it didn't take uh, it didn't take many mistakes. There wasn't many mistakes to be had out there. Both offenses executing at a high level. It pains me to say that. And as a defensive guy, you'd like to see a little bit more resistance. But, you know, the offense was dialed in. The, the coordinators giving the quarterbacks the right plays. The, the quarterbacks, you know, making the right throws. Receivers making great catches. Uh, I don't know where I would put any complaints or where I would complain with this offense because it was dialed in. That's it for us here in the studio. What are you going to do in the second half of the game's going on? Yeah, I'm going to kick back and watch all these monitors. We'll keep you up to date on everything going on around the country right now. Time for the second half with Brad and Kirk. All right, Reese, David, thanks, guys. Just about set to start the third quarter. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. And he is drilled at the 16. He just blew past the blockers and dragged the quarterback down. Boy, excellent play by the defense here. A few extra seconds, and those receivers might have been open. Defense looking for another sack in the second down and long situation. Oh, 
and he's level at the 30. That's good for a game of 14 yards. That'll make it 35. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. And he's tackled at the 39. Number one makes the tackle at the 39 yard line. First down. Finds the junior. And they make the stop around the 48 yard line. Number 45 brings him down at the 48 yard line. That'll make it second and inches. He might have a chance. They'll bring him down at the 38. That's a team of 14 yards on the ball. First down. Gets it out to him again. Tackle made at the 29. That brings up second and one. Got some open field. Nice run there as they work the outside. That's good for a gain of four. This is the eighth play of this drive. That makes it first and ten. Gets out to around the 15. That's good for a gain of 10 yards. That'll make it six in inches. The 10. Nice catch on that one. Tackle at the 8-yard line. Gain of 7 yards. That makes it first and goal. Tackles him hard at the six. That brings him second and goal. He gets out to about the six yard line. Quick strike to the receiver, touchdown. his third touchdown catch of the ball game. It's really not too crazy. He's just running good, clean routes and catching the ball when it comes his way. Here's the PAT to tie this thing up. He splits the uprights with the extra point. Looks like they're ready for the kick. He really got a hold of that kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. You don't want to squander any possessions, but maybe now's the right time to dip into your bag of tricks a little. Think about some gadget plays to catch the defense napping. They go with the runner. He's taken down behind the line. That's a loss of three yards on the play. That brings up second and 13. Second and 13. Ball on the 22-yard line. Makes it out to about the 39. He's on the run. And down he goes at the 47. He makes it out to maybe the 49 yard line. No game. That makes it second and ten.
Oh, and big hit there to stop him. Number 22 makes the tackle at the 49-yard line. Third down. They bring him down. Coaches don't like it when their quarterback gets hit like that. Don't be surprised to see the old coach get on his lineman to protect the quarterback a little bit better. The sack makes this a fourth and very long. He puts it away, and it's a great kick. So this one goes into the end zone, and that'll be a touchback. Now's when you start to approach each drive, thinking that if you take the lead, then the momentum you gain feels that much more powerful. Pressure coming. And he hits him hard at the 12-yard line. The smart quarterbacks and offensive linemen have a really unique relationship. A quarterback should take care of his offensive linemen. But after that play and that hit, you really got to be wondering what kind of relationship this quarterback and his offensive linemen have after that. They find themselves in a hole here after that sack. It's second and long. Pass complete and taken down immediately. That's a game of six on the ball. That brings us third and 12. Let's go, defense. Let's go, go check, check. Disco yeah. Raver. Disco yeah. Raver. Yeah. 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 Let's it go. Hey, that's a heads up play there by the defender. Get those hands up, and something good may just happen. Excellent punt. And down he goes at the 33. A lot of times you'll see teams start to clench up a little bit when games stay close well into the second half. You need to stay loose, keep doing what you've been doing all week in practice, and execute when it's time. He steps out at the 29-yard line. Call it a loss of four yards on the play. That makes it second and 14. From their own 29-yard line, it's second down. And they're going to put six DBs on the field to counter that five-receiver look. So with one quarter remaining and a 28-28 tie. We played three quarters even. Fourth quarter is going to tell the difference. Mike seven. Mike seven. Ready? Three. There's a strike complete. He's taken down at the 33 yard line. Gain of four on the play. That'll make it 39. They'll line up with five wide receivers. He wants it all. And he's got it. Brought down around the 11-yard line. Fires right side. Got his tailback. Makes it second and eight. Mike seven. Easy, easy. easy. Dumps it complete the tight end over the middle. He makes the PAT. This one away. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. 
Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. Throws it and oh, he dropped it. The defensive coordinator did a great job with the play call there. He put his defense and alignment in a position to be able to make a play on the football. Everything worked perfectly. They just dropped the football. Boy, the offense caught a break there. And he makes it out to about the 27-yard line. They go with the screen here, and the halfback's got it. He's got 300 yards passing now. You can tell the quarterback's done a really good job of preparing because he's read the defense like a pro all day long. And it's not too often you get a game like this from your quarterback, but it doesn't matter because these guys are still losing in the game. And he's tackled at the 31-yard line. You know this is a real crucial time in the game. It could still go either way. Oklahoma State is up seven. Slings it. And he's taken down at the 40. He sails it long. Complete the 10. He scores. What a play. What more can we say about this guy? Five touchdowns on the day. Simply an unbelievable display of passing that we've seen today. Tacks on the extra point. A quick two-play, 69-yard drive, and it's good for seven points. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He sends this one deep. And they can forget about returning this one. And what a game it's been for this quarterback, Kirk. Well, this is an example of this quarterback just really being able to go out and show his competitive spirit. And each time he plays, he puts that out on display. This offense still has a lot of work to do, and it's going to be an uphill battle. So you wonder what kind of excitement we'll see this time around. Less than three minutes in the game. Now he's scrambling, and he can't get away from the pressure. From their own 23-yard line, it's second down. Got a man tackled for a loss. That's a loss of about five. Well, that play was sort of out of sync from the start, but you have to also recognize that the defense made a great play. They read it from the get-go. Toughness here by this quarterback sitting in until the last second, trying to make a play downfield, only to have this defense get to him. He's got to do a better job, maybe feeling things out a little bit, but at least he has the awareness and a toughness to sit in that pocket. He's at midfield. He gets out to about the 42 yard line. Last drive ended with as good a result as you can hope for, and I'm sure they'd like to replicate that here. Well, it's one thing to have speed, 
It's another thing to have an idea of what you're doing, how to attack defense. And right now, these wide receivers clearly have done an outstanding job in being able to make their reads and getting out of their breaks, and the quarterback put the ball right on the mark. They come out in a five-wide set. He's at the 30. Loose football. It's picked up. He makes his way out to about the 25. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 25. The Red Raiders use their second timeout. Just under two minutes in the game. The Red Raiders, they're going to have to call their third and final timeout. And that run got stuffed. Yeah, you're right. The defense definitely won the battle with the line of scrimmage there. Gains his way to the 16-yard line. Offensive line and drops it back for a loss. Fourth down. They'll call on the field goal unit here. He gets it up, and it splits the uprights. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He just drills this one. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. I'm sure there are a lot of fans out there hoping for a miracle, but I seriously doubt we're going to see one today. To his receiver. That's a great tackle at the 30 yard line. Number one makes the set tackle at the 30 yard line. That brings the second. The spike will stop the clock. That'll make it third and five. It's third and five. Ball on the 30 yard line. Got it and brought down immediately. That's going to do it for this one. Our final score, Oklahoma State 45, Texas Tech 28. So that wraps things up for us. For EA Sports and Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you next time.